Hey everybody, welcome back to Jimmy's Promo, and today we're going to talk about one of my favorite features that's a part of your Samsung Galaxy devices, and it especially comes in handy if you're traveling, if you're traveling especially with your family or with kids, and it's a way that you're able to have your auto hotspot go on when you leave your house or when you leave any saved network. So let's say, for example, this tablet over here, I'm going to show you kind of how this works and I'll show you how you get everything set up. So this is the Sun's tablet. Usually it's in a little protective, you know, green cover case thing. So let's say that we leave the house. So currently we are connected to a, a Wi-Fi network. So this is the one that we have at home. And so let's say that we just go inside of here and we forget it. So it's almost as if we just left the house. Now, currently, let's say that we're in the car, we're going to the airport, wherever we may be going, and we see this right here. It just says Jimmy's S3 Ultra. So we can just simply tap on that, and then it's going to auto-connect uh, to my device over here. So we're gonna tap right there, and it's going to connect. So it's pretty nice because we don't have to type in the code or password or whatever, because everything is saved through my Samsung account. You can see that this tablet over here has my Samsung account logged in. So if I go right over here, let's say I go inside of uh, the mobile hotspot. When you take a look at it over here, you can see that with my auto hotspot, I am logged in with Jimmy Promo, which is basically just my, my account that I'm using for my Samsung account. So anything that is a part of my account, let's say I have another tablet or I have another cell phone. So for example, let's say that we have this one right here. Uh, we'd be able to do the exact same thing. So I can just tap right there because currently we're not connected to a network and it's finding my auto hotspot. And without, again, typing in my passcode, I'm able to get this one logged in as well because basically it has the, the authority and the right to have it uh, be connected. Because again, it is a part of just my normal hotspot because it's, you know, my uh, uh, Samsung account. So down here you can see the connected devices. I have my Tab A7 Lite and my Z Fold 4. So what's how you're able to basically set this one up is over here on the tablet that you would like to have this auto hotspot basically work. What you want to do is you want to go inside of your Wi-Fi networks or this Wi-Fi uh, wi settings, which is just right here. You scroll down, you go inside of Wi-Fi just by pressing and holding. On the top right hand side, this is where you go inside of intelligent Wi-Fi. And inside of intelligent Wi-Fi, this is where you see auto hotspot connection. And then you only have three options. You can either have never, which means that it'll just never connect. You have this one here, which is ask before connecting. And then you have this one here, which is always. So it'll just always connect. Now, if you want to take a look at that screen on a different device, let's say this one over here, you're going to have a little bit more options inside of Wi-Fi. So again, on the top right hand side, you go into intelligent Wi-Fi. Uh, you can see a bunch of options here. This is where we go to auto hotspot. So again, you can either have never, ask before connecting, or always. Uh, and then you also have the option too where you can disconnect it when not in use. So if the tablet is not using the Wi-Fi, we walk away, then it'll just basically disconnect. Uh, you know, maybe if they're taking a nap in the car and I'm still in the vehicle, obviously driving with my auto hotspot on. If they take a nap, this thing is really not in use. Maybe we tap the power button or we just hit on stop on everything. Then it'll just basically disconnect when it's not in use. So that is how you connect it with the tablet or phones that you want this auto hotspot connection to work. So just make sure you go inside of your connections. You go inside of intelligent Wi-Fi. And inside of that hotspot connection, you just go to usually ask before connecting. That's probably the one that I would do. So how you're able to get this started and get it going from the device that you will be pulling from. So this right here, I'm setting up. So this way other devices can connect to my mobile hotspot. You just want to go inside settings. You want to press and hold on that little quick settings for mobile hotspot. Currently it is turned on, uh, but down here is where you have auto hotspot. And this is the option that you want to turn on over here. So this way, uh, if somebody wants to auto connect, it'll turn on the mobile hotspot for you. So right before we did this, my mobile hotspot was off, but because the auto hotspot was on, it kicked it on and then everybody connected automatically. And up here, this is where you can go to configure and you can change your network name, the password, which this password was one I literally just put in there and made up about five minutes ago before this video. So you wouldn't really see the, the password that I normally use. Uh, but 
The cool thing is that because I just changed it, it still worked over here. So even though this connected with a previous password, because I changed it, it still again automatically connects. So that's where you can go to configure. Uh, so when you turn on the auto hotspot, you also have a little bit more uh, settings. So this is where again that toggle is for on and off. This is my account. So if you want to check to make sure you know what account you're logged into. So this is my Jimmy promo account. And also because I have a family member that is a part of my Samsung account because she has her own Samsung account, because we are family members, I can actually turn this on. So this way she can also go off of my auto hotspot as well. So this is just a my family. This is like a family sharing. Uh, she has her own Samsung account. I have mine, but because we're connected, she can still use it. This just means up here for my account, any tablet or any cell phone that's logged in with uh, my, my, my Samsung account, they are automatically able to log in, which is how this one works over here because this one does not have a SIM card inside. This one's only connected to Wi-Fi. Currently, it's actually just connected to this mobile hotspot right now. So this is all you would have to do to get everything set up, even with family members, where when you turn on this auto hotspot, it's able to allow them to connect. So again, let's say that we go through and I wanted to, let's say, turn off the Wi-Fi. I'm gonna also turn off my mobile hotspot up here because you can still see that my auto hotspot is on. So you can see the mobile hotspot is turned off. So let's say that we go right back on home and I go inside of Wi-Fi again. With this one, I'm gonna turn on my Wi-Fi so this way I can try to connect to some network. I'm gonna choose this one right here, Jimmy's S23 Ultra. As it's connecting, boom, you can see that mobile hotspot has been turned on. So this, again, the reason why it's helpful, the son is usually sitting in the back of the car. He's able to tap on this little button right here. And then now he's automatically connected without me having to turn on settings as I'm driving, taking my hands or eyes off the road. It turns it on for me. He's automatically connected because again, we are signed into the same Samsung account. Now, if you have family members who are old enough who have their own Samsung account and they're, you don't have their, like you don't have your Samsung account set up on their tablet or their cell phone, just share it through the family and all you'd have to do is just go inside of your Samsung account settings and go through your profile information and add in all of your family members. But this was everything I wanted to share with you today, which is the auto mobile hotspot where other devices that is a part of your Samsung account or family group is able to turn on and automatically connect to your Wi-Fi network when they are not connected to something else that's already previously saved. So hopefully you guys have found this video to be helpful. Uh, hopefully you guys have liked it. Uh, with the device that you are trying to connect to, all of the settings you wanna go on to is inside of the Wi-Fi settings, inside of the intelligent Wi-Fi. When it comes down to the source, of where the mobile hotspot is coming from. You go inside of mobile hotspot settings and this is where you go to auto hotspot and you just turn it on. So hopefully you guys appreciated this video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to hit subscribe. Subscribe on the very bottom left hand side. And if you like this video, then more than likely you'll also like this video. And I'll see you guys later.